Hey guys, don't know we pick up video today. I've been working on this deal for the last um, month or so. Um, finally got around to, um, to picking it up tonight. And here we got is 97 packs of these vintage 2001 Pokemon Real and Stickers by Tops. Um, the box is a wee bit in rough shape, but for the price, she had them priced at, oh, I don't really want to say, but good, good price anyway. Um, and then I saw that first, then I went over to the next thing, and she had um, almost a booster box of the top two Series 2 cards. The box, here you can see, is beat up, a bit sun faded on the front. It's obviously been out and about, but um, they had... I put the cards in the um, um, graded card holders, so they just keep them in better condition. So got one, two, three, four, five, six. Jesse and James packs, and a few of the Ash Ketchum. They're quite nice looking cards, or packs anyway. And probably my favourite one here are the rest of these Ash and Pikachu. Uh, really nice cards. These were yeah extremely cheap. These were the definitely the buy the buy of the day. And then because she also had um, folders of the old stickers, which a lot of these are multiple deep. So they're really nice. The old stickers. You can see the prices there that so you had on them. But I did a bulk deal and just bought, bought, um, bought the whole lot really. Because what got me into this deal is that I said that I um, collect uh, boxing cards. Or well, wanted to get boxing cards but haven't found any. And she said she had a whole heap. So, and she said, oh, I was asked for all the auto clicks. So I just hit the, obviously the old Pokemon. It's my main, my main, main item I click so these are quite cool sleeves for the um the obviously made for the stickers they hold four so the whole year see your four rows of three or four rows of four actually you so have 16 per sleeve which I've never seen before which are quite cool because to be fair I probably will be selling a lot of these stickers as to help um, cover my cost, I did. I did. I didn't. They weren't an absolute steal of a price. They were a good price, but they were had to have a few zeros on the end of my offers. Or she priced them up anyway. Had a checklist, so I was happy to pay her prices. So it wasn't like me go around and make her offer. She had a list there of what she wanted, and her Pokemon was. Definitely undervalued, but her other stuff was pretty much um, bang on with prices. As she did own a card shop years ago. Oops, gonna... Got a few more pages to go here. And these things here coming up are really cool. These are... Um, the ones that change, and they are made by Artbox, which is it's quite hard to come by these. But they're obviously yeah, interchangeables. And she's saying these were really expensive to buy in back in the day because she used to import. But she had no sealed stuff of that, but that's yeah, pretty much this first folder here. And then she also had all the boxing cards, so these obviously just won't go for all these, but hundreds and hundreds of them. I pulled out most of the good ones here. Um, that's like a gold, Battle of the Ages, Highfield, and yours is here, Sugar Ray Leonard's, um, Lennox, oh, Larry Holmes, a few of them. I just pulled these out. Lennox Lewis, George Foreman, Buster Douglas, quite a few of the Rocky, Mark 
Marvin Hagler, Joe Frazers, they're just really nice cards. You suddenly listen. Chevy's. Hard to see through the lens here. Roger Mayweather. Got four of them. Probably one of my favourite. Well, the best coach of all time. Cuss. Obviously, Mike Tyson's big dog. Sugar Ray Leonard. Roy Jones. Dempsey. Another really good boxer. More Roy Jones. Oh, those are some other ones I had from. Not from that. And also from the her, I bought this Hot Wheels sealed box. And uh, Austin Powers. These were pretty much full retail. She had these bang on prices. And also the boxer man united football cards and that was the deal from her so then also opened up quite a few packs today of just loose random stuff and found a shiny jonah lomu a few others and a few wayne gretzky's and another big deal at one of the card shops here in christchurch i swapped the v max charizard for this kpj um nine Really nice card, rookie card. And the Eric, which is a nine prism. So I swapped those two for the VMAX Charizard. And then I also bought from them, which is Refractor, um, Hakeem. Only came back a PSA 7, I don't know why, because it's in very nice condition. But yeah, this has been my, been my week, or my day actually. It's been a very busy day, buying cards. Cheers to everyone who subbed and watched the channel, it all helps and we'll catch you on the next one.